Imagine sticking needles into your skin to alleviate pain. Sounds counterintuitive, right? This practice, known as acupuncture, is thousands of years old. It's a cornerstone of traditional Chinese medicine. Acupuncture, along with other ancient healing techniques, presents a paradox. These methods seem illogical by modern medical standards, yet their efficacy is undeniable. They offer a glimpse into the vast, untapped potential of ancient wisdom. These practices force us to confront the limitations of our current understanding. They challenge us to explore the fringes of scientific knowledge. Could these ancient civilizations have possessed knowledge beyond our comprehension? Or is there a scientific basis we haven't yet uncovered? For millennia, ancient cultures relied on these techniques. They used them to treat a wide range of ailments. From physical injuries to mental distress, these methods offered solace. They were passed down through generations. These practices became deeply ingrained in their cultures and belief systems. These practices weren't based on superstition. They were rooted in observation. Ancient healers observed the interconnectedness of the human body. They understood the delicate balance of various elements within. They developed healing modalities that addressed this holistic view. Modern medicine, with its emphasis on empirical evidence, often struggles to explain these ancient techniques. The mechanisms of action remain shrouded in mystery. This lack of scientific explanation has led to skepticism. Some dismiss these approaches as mere placebo effects. However, dismissing them entirely would be a mistake. Numerous studies have shown the efficacy of practices like acupuncture and pain management. Herbal remedies are gaining acceptance as sources of potent medicinal compounds. Ancient Practices, Modern Miracles Acupuncture, with its insertion of fine needles at specific points, is believed to regulate the flow of qi, or vital energy. Herbal remedies, utilizing the potent properties of plants, address ailments at their root. Then there's energy healing, like Reiki. This practice seeks to manipulate the body's energy field to promote healing. These practices, while seemingly disparate, share a common thread. They view the body as an interconnected system, not just a collection of individual parts. This holistic approach sets them apart from the often fragmented nature of modern medicine. A triumph over modern medicine. There are countless anecdotal accounts of ancient practices achieving what modern medicine couldn't. Consider the case of a woman suffering from chronic migraines. Countless medications provided no relief. Her life was consumed by debilitating pain. In a last-ditch effort, she turned to acupuncture. To her astonishment, the migraine subsided. This case, while anecdotal, highlights a crucial point. The efficacy of these ancient practices should not be dismissed. While scientific validation is crucial, so too are the lived experiences of those who have benefited. The Enduring Allure of Ancient Healing Ancient healing techniques continue to intrigue and baffle us. Their enduring presence speaks to their efficacy. They offer a different perspective on health and healing. These methods remind us that our understanding of the human body is far from complete. As we venture further into the cosmos of scientific discovery, we must remain open to the wisdom of the past. Perhaps within these ancient practices lie the keys to unlocking new frontiers in health and well-being. I invite you to share your thoughts on these ancient practices. Are there modern equivalents that intrigue you? Let's keep the conversation going. What are your thoughts?